certainly a lot of VIPs in Mercedes-Benz Stadium tonight. And one of those VIPs is a nine-year-old boy from the New York area. And he's very important because of his community service work. Uh, Kerry Charles caught up with him at halftime and joins us now with more on his story. Did he have a good time? Oh, no, no, he didn't have a good time. He had a great time. This little guy out here with his family enjoying the game, enjoying the halftime show. He says that this is an example of when you give back that other people notice and then they reward you for it. That wasn't his intent when he started out to help people affected by Hurricane Maria. A big game took place Sunday night inside of Mercedes-Benz Stadium, Super Bowl 53. So I think it's a good game. I think both of the teams really want it, and they're trying their best to get a touchdown and try to win the Super Bowl. I'm just happy to be here in Atlanta watching the Super Bowl. Happy and grateful, we met Jaden Perez before the big game. We learned the Giants sent the nine-year-old to Atlanta to see the Rams take on the Patriots. It was all because of his good deeds. I think it counts, and I think it was worth it. Doing good is the right thing to do. I think I inspire people. I think this is the most amazing, unexplainable experience that anybody can experience. After Hurricane Maria, he collected toys, clothes, and other donations for people in Puerto Rico. More than 1,000 donations. I, I, I feel happiness when I give to people. I can't express how I feel. My love and unconditional for him with the way he is, his beautiful heart. I'm just extremely proud of him. Giving back earned him a seat in the stadium where he watched the halftime show live. I think it was great. Um, Maroon 5, big boy, everyone there. I love the halftime show. It made me really fun. I think it was like one of the best halftime shows in the world. I think Jaden is a little analyst, I would say. We got to get him on the entertainment beat. He says it's so important that people give back. He hopes that his classmates will pay attention to his story and decide to get involved. Live tonight in downtown Atlanta, Carrie Charles, Fox 5 News. Russ. Uh, setting such a fine example. So glad he had a great time at Mercedes-Benz tonight. All right. So